is how you do it in New York. You get a brown bag, you go to a deli or a bodega, I believe they're called. Two bacon and egg, and one classic bacon, egg and cheese. 11.50 for all three of us to have a breakfast roll, not bad. This is a great window to vlogging. Imagine living here, the lighting. I don't think Joe will be that keen. If you move to New York? No. No. Oh, that's the point, probably should say that for the video actually. Joe's not here, New York's not Joe's vibe. <laughs> she's been here before, she's done it once. Once was enough. So Joe is holding down the fort back home. Come on, everyone get in. Right, ready? You can see, that's it, you go there, Dad can go here. Dad, you need to duck down. Mm. 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 Very nice. Not bad. Top of the morning to you. Very nice. Cheers, cheers everyone. Cheers everyone. That was gone. like star constellations on the ceiling a little feature it's been in a lot of films was it the untouchables i think that was filmed here friends with benefits oh that clock there in the middle that's a tiffany clock it's the most expensive tiffany clock in existence apparently very famous meeting point i've said it each time i come here the train stations in new york are the best aren't they yeah. you've got this and then yesterday we saw Oculus as well, the World Trade Center one. We did. The Americans know how to do a good train station, I think, don't you? Known from lots of films, but it's great. If you're a photographer, you'll get some good pictures here as well. It's, uh, yeah, well worth a visit. And we've got an Apple store this side as well, so you can, uh, all your Apple needs can be serviced while you're here. There you go, we're out. We're in Manhattan now. There's a crane all the way up there. Thinking of you, Liam. That's the outside of Grand Central, in case you were wondering. So this is Summit 1 Vanderbilt, we think, which is the newest observation deck in New York. Not going up that one, but there it is anyway. That's taking pictures of everything. Lots of landmarks here. You've got Grand Central, you've got the Chrysler Building, you've got the MetLife Building, you've got Summit 1 Vanderbilt, you've got a yellow cab, you've got another yellow cab. There you go. This feels a bit more like real Manhattan here. So this is the library. Do you remember, did you see the movie The Day After Tomorrow? Yeah. Do you remember when they all had to rush into the library because the water was coming? Yeah. That was here. Yes, this is the one. New York Public Library. Another beautiful building. For a country that's not that old, America has some beautiful buildings, I've got to say. something to eat, a coffee, and a cup of coffee and a slice of cake. There we go, that is the Flatiron building right there. When Joe and me came here last time, they said scaffolding on it, and then five years later, the scaffolding is still there. I'm not destined to see this building without scaffolding. We are in Madison Square Park, and that right there is the original Shake Shack. If you've been to Shake Shack anywhere in the world, that is the original one. Joe and me did it in a video, which I will link down below. Five years ago, that was right here. We're not gonna go there because we're not feeling a burger. It's not burger vibes right now. It's more a uh, coffee and a snack. Madison Square Park, we've even got a bit of live music. It's a bite. Yes, thank you very much. Got a coffee, a croissant, a bottle of water. Oh, and these, what are these? This. It's a taste of Italy, mate. <laughs> in New York. Oh yeah, these do go well with coffee, don't they? Look at that. Brave the rain, a little rain spell. When in Macy's, wasn't really for us, was it? No, it wasn't. Really Recognise this spot? One more time, I look at each other. What you got? All right, then let's do yeah. some FaceTimes. Joe, you're in the video. Give a wave. <laughs> <laughs> I told Dad that when we're in Times Square, you don't give people eye contact, otherwise they try and sell you something. So, it's got shades. If Grace was here, this is where she'd be going. 
Mum and dad are going in by the looks of things. All right, let's go. There you go, this is for you, Grace, this bit of the video. These are those bags, Grace bites. Oh, that's a good New York one, isn't it? The pizza slice, like that. This is what I like. This is my only bit of Disney that I'm interested in. Always wanted a Buzz Lightyear, never got one. I never had a Buzz Lightyear, you never got me one. You were 18 at the time. It's all too much for some people. Go, Grace, if you didn't pick up, this is a record that we did try to call you while we were in here. We didn't give it, oh, she is there, there she is. We've got M&M World, that's pretty much the same in every city in the world that you go to. I'm not bothered, are you? Do you fancy dinner with a show? You've got to join the queue for Ellen's Stardust Diner. Here we go, this will be us tonight, Back to the Future. I think it's called Winter Garden Theatre or something. So we're coming here tonight, we're gonna to have a bit of dinner and have a proper Broadway night. Our first Home Alone 2 location. Macaulay Culkin reads his map somewhere here, I think. We're too hungry and too hot and too tired to stop long though. It's time for food, it's two o'clock, we still haven't had lunch. Was it a cob salad? Chicken salad. Chicken salad. Chicken salad, I've gone a bit Big basic, I've gone for a pret, ham and cheese and salad. Just needed something to tide us over, but it's not a bad spot for a bit of dinner, is it? In front of Radio City. The feet are starting to ache, and we were in need of a sit down and a baguette. That's exactly what we've done, even though it's a bit, it's a bit of a cheat to go to a chain. You know, it's nice to try the independent spots, but sometimes only a pret baguette will do. There's a half hour till we've got to go to the top of the rock, so thought we'd come and have a look at where the Christmas tree was in Home Alone 2, our favourite Christmas film. And of course the ice rink is down here as well, so let's have a look. So in Home Alone 2, that's where the Christmas tree is. That's where Kevin comes to meet up with his mum. Or his mum comes to meet here to find him, doesn't she? I never made it onto this ice rink and I don't think I ever will. I can get around without holding onto the sides though. Nothing more spectacular than that, sadly. We are going all the way to the top. How do you feel about going all the way up there? There we go, that's a nice big chandelier, isn't it? My word. It's cool that that is exactly, that's where this is. In building this building, they did that photo. <laughs> that's a long way, isn't it? That river is the Hudson River, and actually about there is where Sully's plane landed. About here where my finger is, is where that happened, the miracle on the Hudson. You've got the view this side of Central Park, and then if you go to the other side, you've got the view of Empire State Building, World Trade Center, Statue of Liberty in the distance there as well. There's actually five observation decks in New York. I think this is my favorite, this one. It's not so high that you feel like you're out of the action, you're in among it. And you've got two separate views, which I quite like. So if you're trying to choose top of the rock, it's got me. <laughs> That's so fun. Imagine if we did that. That's the thing, isn't it? You can't take hundreds and hundreds of photos. They don't do it justice, do they? They never do it justice. Look at those. It's important to put your camera away and have a look at it with your own eyes. And that is what I'm going to do right now. This is clearly a shop about football by Americans. The world's greatest soccer store. I bet it's not. See, my view on Times Square is, it's great for a bit. You come here, you get your photos, but then I'm done. We've ended up in Hard Rock Cafe at the bar. 
because there was no seats. We did book a table at Bubba Gump, but they uh, said they didn't have space for us. Very odd. Very disappointing that was, wasn't it? I felt. But very disappointed. But we've ended up at the bar, Hard Rock Cafe next door. They've saw it. We're lucky, really. You don't have to reserve seats to sit at the bar. So we've scored the last three. Thank the Lord, because I am hungry. Party starts here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Barbecue burger, fried chicken sandwich, and barbecue burger. Right, there we go. We're back out in the uh, quaint little crossroads that is Times Square. Did we, uh, Hard Rock was all right, wasn't it? Hard Rock was fantastic. Pretty good. Better than Bubba Gumps. Better Bubba than Gumps. Bubba Gumps. Going for a show. Now we're going back to the future. Broadway. Back to Broadway, back to the future. Don't get me wrong, it is cool to visit, but I don't know. I'm from Devon. I'm used to the peace and quiet, not the chaos of this. <laughs> We've got the most expensive beer in all the land, branded cup, which we get to take home just as well, because uh, for the round it was about $50.